What is roundabout junction? A roundabout is a one-way, circular intersection where the traffic flows around a central island. Key components of roundabout. Circulatory carriageway. The circular section of the road over the roundabout is called a circulatory carriageway. Inscribed circular diameter, ICD. The size of the roundabout is measured from its ICD means inscribed circular diameter. ICD is measured from the outer edges of the circulatory carriageway passing through the center of the roundabout. Entry point. When a vehicle enters one of the arms of the roundabout, the first contact point is called the entry point. Central Island. The central piece of the roundabout is called Central Island and it's a non-trafficked area. It is not advisable to place trees, advertising boards, etc. at the outer edge of the Central Island because it will create visibility obstruction for drivers. Arms and Splitter Island. The roads joining the roundabout are called Arms and Splitter Islands are provided at each arm to provide pedestrian crossing facilities. Roundabout Design Guidelines UK DMR BCD 116, formerly known as TD 16, is world known design guide for roundabout design. It covers a complete guide on geometric design of roundabout, signal controlled roundabout design, mini roundabout design, and design of associated features like pedestrian footways, cycleways, etc. Roundabout Design Best Practices a compliant design roundabout would surely be considered a safe design for all road users, but best design practices coupled with design guidance make the infrastructure safe, economical, and eco-friendly by adding further values as below. Entry Path Radius The entry path radius is a deflection imposed on the vehicles while entering the roundabout and it is the minimum best fur curve required to govern the speed of the vehicle to make the junction safe. Roundabout Visibility It is very important to provide desirable minimum visibility to address the following conditions. Stopping sight distance at the entry point. Visibility along the circulatory of the roundabout. Exit visibility. Swept path analysis. Swept path analysis is one of the key design inputs of any junction design and roundabout is no different. However, roundabout provides a free flow movement with right of way, row, and give way operation facilities. It's very important that swept path is carried out following similar operational parameters and the most onerous vehicle is used for the swept path analysis. Pedestrian and cycling facilities at the roundabout. Pedestrian and cyclist facilities play a very important role, especially in the case of urban street design. The facilities for disabled users, visually impaired users, wheelchair users are as important as for vehicular traffic. Therefore, it is very important for the designer to consider longitudinal gradient, cross falls, drop curb locations, refuge islands locations, tactile, segregation between pedestrians and cyclists, etc. adequately and develop a robust junction layout to facilitate the road user movements efficiently and comfortably. Innovative Roundabouts Innovation is the mantra of consistent improvement in any field and it applies to the roundabout design too. Various value engineering and innovative solution has been implemented in the roundabout design. The two well-known innovative roundabout designs that has been constructed in European countries like Netherlands, the UK, etc. are Dutch style roundabout Dutch style roundabouts are suitable for urban junctions where high pedestrian movement is expected. Dutch style roundabout provides a low speed vehicular traffic environment and segregated high end pedestrian and cycle facilities. Along with this, the roundabout provides robust facilities for disabled road users, visually impaired road users, wheelchair and pushchair road users. Turbo Roundabout Turbo Roundabout is another very innovative roundabout concept that provides spiral traffic flow at the junction to increase capacity and make the junction safer by reducing the number of conflict points. Turbo Roundabout was first constructed in Netherlands and since then it has gained immense popularity. Advantages of Turbo Roundabout Reduction in Conflict Points Standard dual lane entry slash exit roundabout comes with 16 conflict points. 12 at entry, 2 at weaving, 
and two at Qden, however, Turbo Roundabout reduces it to 10 conflict points at the entry. Low Speed Environment Standard dual lane entry slash exit roundabout provides 40 km per hour to 50 km per hour speed during off peak times, therefore, may fly through the junction and generate a potential for accidents. However, Turbo Roundabout provides a low speed environment of 30 km per hour to 35 khp speed during the off peak hours and creates a relatively safer environment. Higher Junction Capacity Due to its innovative geometric design, Turbo Roundabout normally provides 25% to 30% additional capacity to the junction. Thanks for watching. I hope the video provides you with adequate information on the roundabout and its associated features. Please feel free to like, share and comment.